Right now, we're in the desert. This is no place for fun and games. You do not want to get lost out here. But every year, stupid tourists get lost out here every week. <laughs> Got a little rough on the dismount, but uh, we're good. Let's go. Come on. It's been nearly three minutes, and I'm completely starving. I need to eat fast, or my tummy's gonna hurt. I have to be really careful. These are one of the most dangerous creatures of the desert. The hippopotamus. I don't think he saw me yet, so we're still good. But I was wrong. Alright, I'm gonna sneak up from his rear and grab him. That's where I'll take him, right? This is incredibly dangerous, so don't ever try this at home. Do it somewhere else. It was a bit risky, but it's gonna be worth it. Uh, you can pretty much find these uh, these canned vegetables pretty much anywhere you go, uh, especially in the deserts. Uh, you just gotta know where to look and. Uh, uh, that is just. That is just awful. This is just awful. It was awful. Luckily, uh. There's a technique that I heard about from my mother's father's grandson where you just take a big whiff oh, and uh, that is much, much better. Much better. The ancient natives used this technique to absorb half the vitamins and minerals because half the taste is in the smell. Alright, we really need to get moving. We have a lot of ground to cover. I have to get moving now before the sun goes down because I'm afraid of ghosts. And that's about enough for today. I need to find some shelter. I think it's about time to find some shelter because I don't know what time it's gonna get dark here. But uh, luckily, uh, I usually I usually have a watch, but uh, luckily I have my cell phone, so I can use it like a sundial. And it's about it's about 10:30 p.m. right now, so we really need to get started. The ancient natives use this technique with their cell phones, but it's not always completely accurate. I was off by about six hours. I have to work hastily because the sun is going down and I need something to protect me from all the predators and aliens. So I've been working about five hours now and uh, I, think I, got, I think I got enough shelter to last me the night. Right here. But it's no time for rest. I have to get moving. This terrain is incredibly disorientating, but luckily I can navigate using the stars. So if you can find the star, all you have to do is follow it and it will always, always lead you home. 50% of the time. Unfortunately for me, this was not one of those times. I'm completely lost.